Now, another development we've got up on Infowars.com today. Steelers owner begs fans not to abandon team over national anthem protests. You remember yesterday, we had the big viral story with all the videos of not only Steelers fans, but other NFL fans burning their tickets, burning their jerseys, burning their NFL gear in protest at this disrespect for the American flag for the anthem and everything it stands for. Of course, Villanueva came out for the Steelers, the only player to come out, all the rest of them hid in the locker room. He was forced to apologize. He was forced to walk it back. Oh, everybody gets their free speech. That was the whole mantra after this. Oh, it's just free speech. Unless you actually want to stand and recognize the anthem, then we're going to attack you. In the case of black players who stood for the anthem, we're going to call you the C word. We're going to call you Uncle Tom. Villanueva was forced to walk it back. His own coach of the Steelers attacked him immediately after the game ended. Oh, but now you're going to try and walk it back. Too late. Too late. Steelers president Art Rooney II penned a panicked letter to Steelers fans after the team didn't show up to the field during the national anthem before a game on Sunday. So again, they're reacting to the revolt that's taken place in the, in the 24 hours since. Rooney was, re was responding to the scores of Steelers fans posting videos on YouTube of them burning their Steelers gear and vowing never to support the team ever again. He wrote, the intentions of Steelers players were to stay out of the business of making political statements by not taking the field. BS. They deliberately chose to stay in the locker room to dishonor the anthem. That's why Villanueva got in trouble, because he's the only one who didn't. So it's BS on top of BS. Now they're trying to walk it back because everyone's boycotting them, freaking out. He, he goes on to write, unfortunately, that was interpreted as a boycott of the anthem. Oh, do you think? Do you think not actually showing up for the anthem would be interpreted as a boycott of it? Oh, that was never our, our players' intention, he claims. BS. They, they completely crucified Villanueva for doing the opposite because they all agreed to boycott it before the game. That's what it was all about. So now they're trying to walk it back. What the aging process is, is when the cell replicates, we lose a little bit of our telomeres. Telomeres are the little cups on the end of our chromosomes. Basically. And when it runs out, you start dying. Secure your DNA force today at InfoWarsLife.com.